Well, hello again, and uh, welcome to the VK6CS Fun with Amateur Radio Channel. Um, believe it or not, I do. Uh, I get paid for paid for doing this. I'm driving around in the country, that is not the uh, the ham radio channel. Sadly, um, as you can see, there's the turning out backer antenna. I was. Uh, resurrecting the other day. We've just tuned it, uh, I say we because I'm with with, a, with another radio amateur. Uh, I'm a passenger in the car at the moment, those of you uh, watching in America will be relieved to hear. <laughs> and uh, we heard, on, I heard on the uh, on the WIA news yesterday that Dick Smith was going to be doing aeronautical mobile on 146, uh, uh, sorry on 14146 of a sideband the hour so uh, just put that on the car today we're going for a little drive out in the bush gonna be doing a few hundred k's today and um, put this uh, put this on here on the ball bar tuned it to uh, 14146 inside the car we've got uh, the uh, 857 as you can see it's um, I've used uh, masking tape to hold it to the lid of the uh, the centre console there, which is a, a nice, simple, cheap, temporary way of, uh, of mounting the radio. And uh, I tuned the antenna with my UKITS FG01 uh, antenna analyzer. So, so and uh, it's all set up and it's locked off. Let's see if I can give you a front shot of it. I can't actually see the viewfinder from that angle, but it's okay. If I do that, I can. But as usual, up is down, down is up, left is right, right is left. <laughs> but, um, there we go. So it's set to 14 decimal 146, upper sideband. Set to 50 watts output. You can't see that on there, but it is. And uh, I've locked the dial, which is a nice convenient feature on this radio, because it means I can keep my elbow on the radio uh, without, uh, without um, uh, disturbing anything. So uh, there we go. I'm trying to keep this in. I'm trying to keep this in shot. If you can imagine me sort of holding this at arm's length and then uh, rotating the viewfinder, you'll, you'll, you'll get the idea of what's going on there. So it's not a very, uh, it's not a very easy thing to do. Okay, so that's the uh, that's the temporary flash up in the car. Um, for those of you that are watching outside of Australia. This is not really the Australian outback. This is uh, probably about 150 kilometres outside of Perth, uh, currently heading east towards the town of Meriden. Um, this, uh, we're following along the, uh, the railway line here. See all the utilities take more or less the same route most of the way to uh, Kalgoorlie, which is a gold mining town. Um, this water pipe here is uh, about 600 kilometres long. It takes the water, believe it or not, from Perth to the, uh, the gold mining town of Kalgoorlie. There we go, it's just a little bit of a, oh, just see the uh, the coax there has just slid off the roof, so I just need to be, <laughs> need to stop at the next town and uh, get buy a roll of gaffer tape and just stick that, uh, stick that to the, uh, to the roof. Okay, well I'll, uh, I'll let you know, um, if we get a contact with Dick, I'll, uh, I'll try and record it and uh, I'll put it on the channel. But uh, as you can see, it's a beautiful day for, uh, driving around in, uh, in Western Australia. I'll say sometimes I have to, I have to pinch myself, I get paid for doing it. <laughs> but, uh, fortunately, uh, my boss doesn't know I've got a YouTube channel. Okay, well, as always, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, 